When I study media, I do not study the content. I don't study the idea of the media. I study the nature of the thing itself. <laughs> Another one-liner is for people of very short attention spans. You can't, they won't stay around for you to tell them a story. You have to work fast to slip in with a single gag in one era and out another. And uh, this is where it's at. Now, there's this uh, one-liner about Zeus, who says to his fellow gods, now sisters, watch yourself. What we're doing is we're trying to put McLuhan onto CD, make him more accessible to the young today, because the young are not doing a lot of reading, and the phonetic alphabet is very user-unfriendly for them. So we're going ahead and putting McLuhan onto CD with music so that the kids can start to get a handle on what he was saying. I love those reverses. And this would be very strange to have people actually dancing around to Marshall McLuhan. I mean, he would be a happy guy up there. I want to obviously keep people's attention and uh, I, I envision more of an adult audience when I'm making this because he's an intellectual and that, so I don't want to make him super funky, although some of the stuff is because I can't help but be tempted to do that kind of thing. But uh, I'm just trying to make the music very thoughtful, um, good for sort of psychic reflection. It's not psychic like psychic phenomena, but just, just reflective type stuff so people can pay attention and, and really focus on the words and, and feel soothed and, you know, in, in a sort of meditative state. This is this next stuff is more typical of what the music will be on it. We just want to make something flashy. Yeah, that's true. If we had made this album in the 1930s, people would have it would have been completely incoherent uh, and no one would have been able to make sense. Uh, whether Marshall would like it. I don't know if he'd like it, he might say it's an appropriate use of the medium that we're working in, but privately he probably would have preferred his book. The effects of the media are fantastically unlike what people think. Uh, you're not prepared usually for what you encounter. Often people say the man was ahead of his time. Uh, he wasn't ahead of his time, he was telling everyone what was going on right now, it's just we are so behind the times that he appeared ahead of his time.